Hello, everybody. I am one minute late. I am so sorry. Wait, am I live? Hello, everybody. I am two minutes late. Oh, my Lordy McGordy. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. I hope y'all are still there. Um, for anyone who is joining, if you go under the description of this workout, uh, you will see there's a Spotify playlist. I'm going to point because mine is on the, on the left here. Um, yours may be in a different spot, but make sure you click on it, the more info or click on expand or whatever, because otherwise you're not going to see it. Um, yeah, let's see. I am queuing up my playlist and we're going to wait a couple minutes to see if anybody shows up. Let's wait. <laughs> So quiet. Well, anyway, I'm going to talk about my backpacks while we're all waiting. You don't need one, but I actually went with two. Actually, I feel like this. Okay, so this one is filled with bubble gum and concrete. This one is filled with sleeping kittens. I'm just kidding. Um, it's just a shit ton of books, but I thought it'd be a little more interesting. What is your backpack filled with? Let me know. This is called engagement between me and the audience. So let me know what's in your backpack. Do you have MREs? Are you getting ready to do some survivalist shizit? Um, are you actually taking stuff like picnic on the beach? Please make sure you keep a safe distance if you do that. Um, yeah. All right. I will wait one more minute and then I'm going to get started. Um, so if you are joining in, make sure you queue up your Spotify while I stretch. Um, I got a cool t-shirt. Um, thank you to my stepdaughter for making that for me. That was very sweet. Uh, so you'll see this every week. Um, let's see. While I'm here, uh, let's talk about personal training. Why would you go on personal training at a time like this? I'm giving it away for free, I know. Um, well, maybe you want someone to tell you whether you're doing it right or not. Maybe you're like, I don't know about this move. Am I, is this right? I don't know. Um, or maybe you are like, I've got like a bursitis or I've got this and I can't do some of those moves, but I want, I want to do a workout, but can we work around those? Maybe you're like, I only have a rutabaga and a studebaga. Help me make a workout with that. Or maybe you're like, I want to have a party with my friends, but instead of drinking, we're going to work out because our livers need a break and we'll get buff. Um, I can help you with all those things. So contact me for all your personal training or small group training needs. Zoom is a miracle thing that we can do, or um, we can find out other medias if you don't like to Zoom, Zoom, Zoom. Let's go back to my Do you remember that song? It's from the 90s stuff. It was like, zoom, zoom, zoom. Let's go. It was horrible, horrible song. Um, also, today is sort of the last day of the current schedule that I have posted. Hello, Ashley. Um, so starting next week, uh, there's going to be a whole new schedule. And get, uh, I'm going to post that later today. Ooh. Uh, yeah, just sort of trying to figure out, you know, I, I have friends working out like on three different time zones and trying to work around that and trying to find times that work well for people. Um, won't be perfect. Uh, and there will be some changes. Another thing that's going to change is I'm going to put some of my workouts on Zoom. Uh, so you won't necessarily get to, like, if you miss them, you're going to miss them. Sorry. Uh, but... Um, there's still a lot of different, there'll be some new classes. There's going to be a hit class. Yay. And like some full body work too. All right. So it's getting sort of late six after. So I've got my backpack workout for 11. It's up here or maybe it's down there or maybe it's, I don't know. I don't know how it showed up in your feet. Um, anyway, so it's there. So I'm going to hit play in 
three, two, one, play. Now this workout, or this warm up is gonna be body weight. So we're just gonna do eight moves, uh, one minute each. And um, yeah, let's get this started. All right, so we're just gonna warm up the shoulders. Y, T, W, A. It's nothing new if you've been working out with me. T, palms down. W, squeeze your shoulders. A, reach back. Keep going, I'm gonna adjust the camera so that I'm not the headless trainer. Why? Ooh, that's too, ah. You'd think I'd have this down by now. I've only been doing this for like three weeks. Ah, keep going, keep going, keep going. Don't look at me, don't look at me. Look at me, look at me, look at me. Look at me. 20 more seconds. So earlier this week, I started listening to like all of these 90s soundtracks. So do you recognize what movie this is from? It's Clueless. Rolling with the homies. Three, two, one. We're gonna go into some inchworms. So walk forward into plank. Walk your feet up slowly. Really try to get your legs close to your hands. Turn around, do it again. Get to that good plank position. Oh, oh. I don't think this is Coolio, but this song sounds a lot like um, Fantastic Voyage by Coolio. Got 25 more seconds left. 20 more seconds. Rolling with my homies, yeah, yeah. Three, two, one. All right. So we're gonna stay on one leg, bring it forward, figure four, bend down. Come up, straight out, down. Straight leg, figure four, down. Come back up, straight up, down. Stay on that leg. We're going to switch legs in 35 seconds. Whoop. Ah. Whew. If I didn't have my arms out, help with the balance. We try to get that leg out straight before you bend it. More hamstring work. Why is she making us stretch our hamstrings so much? Got five more seconds. Then we're gonna switch sides. Two, ah! Switch sides, what a good time to switch sides. Again, find a place to spot to focus on the floor if you need help with your balance. And I keep looking at other places. So actually, I want to know, whew, one, if I can balance. Two, what's in your backpacks? Did you put anything fun in there? <sighs> Maybe you have like some old uh, DVDs that are lying around. 10 more seconds. You're going to want something to uh, put under your knees if you have a hardwood floor. Because we're going to be getting down on our knees. Here we go. So we're going to kneel down and step up. What is that? Oh my God, it's a giant millipede. Oh my God. It's crawling away from me, which is good. But my God, it is huge. So earlier this week, there was one in our bathtub, and I flushed it down the bathtub. And I think it's come back. I think this is the one I went down. I know it's going to kill me during this workout. 
<sighs> All right. I want to kill it. I want to step out of bed. I want to mark these shoes. These shoes are so nice. 15 seconds left. Oh, it's coming back. Oh my god, it's like it's like Jaws. Slowly coming to attack. Five, four, three, two, one. Get into a plank, plank jacks. Oh my god, it's like got feathers. Oh. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. All right, we got 45 more seconds. Keep going, I gotta take care of this. Five seconds on 15 seconds off so you're not going to get a lot of break to let that muscle recover so by the time we get to the end it's going to be pretty tough okay so 10 moves we're going to alternate upper body lower body compound movements i think there's a little bit of core work in there i actually over the past two days proceeded to pull not pull but like i'm sore in a lot of places which i like i like being a little bit sore like a little bit sore means you challenge your muscles. Really sore, like you can't move, you overdid it. Okay. So, do whatever you gotta do. Our first move. Oh, wait, I'm gonna turn this down. And I'm gonna actually grab my backpacks. So, I've got a couple backpacks. I'm gonna alternate, see what I'm feeling. They feel actually about the same weight, even though one is like much larger than the other. The headless trainer tells you. All right, our very first one is going to be tricep raises overhead. So you're going to grab your backpack by the handles, okay? 
And you're gonna make sure your butt's not sticking out, keep it at neutral pelvis, and you're just gonna do extension. So the key is to keep your upper arms as straight as you can. There's gonna be a little bit of motion, but try to keep them straight. And we are gonna start in 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, here we go. So lean forward a little bit. I'm gonna try, there we go. We get to a stagger stance, it's gonna be a little easier to keep your torso upright as opposed to leaning forward. And it gives you a little more, it's gonna be a little space. Take your time, we've got two more sets of these. I'm gonna do that torso check. Make sure that's sticking your belly out or anything. Whew, we're going right in with tricep work. Three, two, one. Shake it out. You got a 15 second break. Then we're doing it again. Start in five seconds. Three, two, one. Here we go. Tricep work is always lots of fun. Got 25 more seconds. Whew. This is great. Give me a break. Just rest it out. So up and get right back in it. So I'm like I said, I'm pretty beat up from this week. I did a lot of push-ups on Thursday. My Tabata workout just like killed me in a good way. Three, two, one. Take a break. Shake it out, shake it out. Break it off. Feeling naughty. Shake out your arms. All right, three more seconds. Two. One, last set, here we go. Whew. Now, of course, if you didn't have a backpack, you just do this, the dumbbell, where you can have bands. You can have the band underneath your foot. Oh, goodness. My triceps are sort of toast this week. But I'm gonna keep going. I actually don't even know how much this backpack weighs. So, you got 12 seconds left. Ah! Whew. Five, four, get a few more reps. Three, two, one. Ah! Good job. Ah. Whew. Triceps are hard. Triceps are hard when your triceps are tired. And like I said, you don't get a big rest, so. Definitely will work it. All right, we got a minute 15 for you to just chill. I'm gonna show you the next move. Grab some water. So I'm gonna grab my larger backpack. If you only have one, that's totally cool. I'm gonna grab it by the, the sh uh, shoulder straps as opposed to the handle. Just because I don't wanna push my luck with the stretch that I'm trying to in my backpack. All right, so you're gonna start low. And you're just going to swing up. So kettlebell swings, Russian. When you get to the top of the movement, make sure you straighten the body, squeeze, contract your glutes at the top of the motion, okay? We got 30 more seconds. How's everybody doing? Woo! -hoo. We got 15 more seconds. Wow, this break feels so luxurious. Oh. All right, 10 more seconds. Get ready. Four, three, two, one. So you don't have to swing it overhead. This is not an American kettlebell swing. Just so 
so I don't keep it in the floor. And don't get hit by the straps. If you were here last week, you didn't get those things in the bucket. Two tears in the bucket. Uh oh, never mind. Kids present. Four, three, two, one. Take a break. I like kettlebell swings. I like kettlebells. I don't have any at home. But you know what? If I want one, I can contact Fit Info Fitness 805. They'll hook you up. Put a human behind it instead of Amazon. Two, one. Next round. So Fitness 805, if you want to buy any equipment, like it's time to invest in a treadmill or an elliptical or a bike. They've got all that equipment. If you live in the 805 area, you can get used equipment. If you live anywhere in the US, they can ship to you. So support a local business. They hire me. And if you tell them I suck it, I get a little something something, which is cool because I don't really have a paycheck right now. But that's sort of like, here's my dollars. All right. Three. Wait, no, next three. Three, two, one, take a break. How the kettlebells, how the backpack swings treating you? You have oranges in your backpack. I think your backpack smells lovely. I like it. Three, two, one. Here we go, last round. Do a squeeze and boom, boom at the top of the motion. So remember, when you're doing this, you're using your momentum to swing it up. You're using your core to help end the motion. So to get it to stop and then come back down, that's going to be your legs contracting, but it's also your core to stabilize and get the range of motion that you need. We got five more seconds in this. This one is my fast because it wasn't triceps. Two. One, take a break. Awesome job. Good job, good job, good job. All right. So now we get to luxuriate. In another minute or so. Okay, so this next one, you can stand however you want. As always, the two things you want to watch for, shoulders down and back as opposed to like punching forward. And keeping a nice neutral spine so not sticking your butt out. You don't have to like tuck it under like dramatically. Just find a nice neutral position in between. And now you're just gonna do upright rows. So elbows come higher than your hands. Okay? Now we're just gonna do rows. We've got we just like another 30 seconds. Anything else exciting going on? Good morning, Savvy. Good to see you. Hope you're feeling okay. I know you're having some back issues. Glad you're at least talking about it. Say hi. We're going to start in five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Shoulders down and back. Elbows up higher than your hands. Pull that backpack up, set it down. Ready to go? No, we're staying. Let's go. No, we're staying. Uh, there's a joke in there somewhere. This is what we call a bit of functional fitness. This is something you might do in real life. Functional, picking up a backpack over and over. Three, two, one. Take a break. Say, oh, sorry, your back's not feeling better. I'm gonna send you some good vibes, and we're gonna start up again in three, two, one. Here we go. So, I actually know two people, Sadie, you, and one other person who threw out their backs. It's very sad. Make sure you take it easy, recoup, don't try to push yourself too soon. See what you can do, but if you're 
Not feeling it? Don't go for it, it's not worth it. Oof. That was your public service announcement. I'm so glad I could tell you so many things that you didn't already know. All right, I got 15 more seconds. 10. Three, two, one. Take a break. One more time on that. Shake it out, shake it out, shake it out. Starting up again in three, two, one. I'm gonna try. The nice thing about these uh, hiking backpacks is that there's so many straps. You could try holding in like 18 different positions, which is good because if you have some sort of impingement where it hurts to hold it in a certain area, you can try holding it somewhere else. Remember, Find what works for you. It's one of the nice things about free weights too, like if you were in a machine doing an upright row, you're sort of locked into a certain range of motion, whereas with a free weight, it gives you a little bit of maneuverability. Now sometimes it's bad because you want to be, you know, moving with a certain amount of control. Take a break. But sometimes it's good because it'll allow you to sort of maneuver if you have some sort of limitation in your, in your movement. All right, so that was round three, so we're gonna take a break, and I'm gonna show you the next move. Got a minute? So, so you gotta lean forward in a deadlift. So in the deadlift, my knees are slightly bent, and I wanna think about like sort of scraping, almost scraping my shins with the weight, okay? So, when you get down at the bottom of the movement, your back is flat, you're gonna do a row, and then you're gonna come forward. Imagine your hips are attached to strings, and so the strings are pulling you up into that good position, okay? When you get to the top, squeeze the glutes, okay? So row, come down, row, come down, okay? Remember to protect your back. As I go down into that lift, that lift position, notice my butt's going back. So this isn't like me just like leaning over. It's me, my butt's going back. I'm coming up, okay? I'm gonna start in 10 seconds and see if I can get some water in time. Four, three, two, one. So down, row, up. Down, bro. Up. Now, I'm looking forward with my head. It's putting some strain on my neck. So you don't want to be looking ahead of you. You want to have your gaze sort of just down at the floor when you go down. So imagine just keeping your head you guess it, neutral spine. Two, one, take a break. How's it going? How's it going? People are writing things. You're welcome. Get started. Two, one, here we go. So I actually have like a million books in here, but apparently I didn't pick heavy enough books because for this move, it's not super challenging. Now, when I come back up, I'm feeling it right here. Um, usually because I have some soreness there, but I'm feeling the activation as I come up. Five more seconds. Something pop out? Oh. Um, this backpack is brought to you by REI. Because this little bag fell out of this pocket down here. This is actually an old bag I was using. Two, one, last round. 
It's an old bag I was using before I got sort of a, a bag specifically for when I'm riding my bike. So I wanted a bag that was good for bike riding, but also good for like going to the gym, like having all these different compartments. And the bag I found I actually really like. If you're a gym goer that bikes to the gym, I'd be happy to tell you what it is. But I'm not just going to give this advertisement away for free. Um, I can tell you that it's not my. All right, back. anyway, blah 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 blah. Two, one, take a break. How'd you like that? Doing well? Good job, good job, good job, good job. You're upright rowing? All right, I like it. So again, this workout is for you. And if you know your limitations, you can modify safely, go and do that, okay? Modify as much as you need to. I'm for it. And like I said, if you want a workout designed specifically for you, so you don't have to modify, I can help you with that too. All right, next one. We're gonna put our backpack on. Oh, geez. Okay. So, I'm gonna, whoop. Now I wanna make sure it's tight against your body. All right, so what we're gonna do is, we're just gonna get in a plank, and we're just gonna do plank walks side to side. Now if your backpack isn't super tight against you, like me, it sort of actually helps as a good cue for keeping it steady on your back, not letting it fall off to the side. Now, if you want to wear fancy pants, push-up bar. Okay, so we're going to get started in six seconds. So you can do the plank walk or the push-up walk. Two, one, here we go. So side to side. You can do one motion each side. You can do two steps each side. Remember, same hand and foot. Move together. So right hand, right foot, left hand, left foot. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to do 30 seconds plank walk, and then last 15 seconds push up walk. Okay? Here we go. Enjoy that extra weight. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Take a break. I'm gonna grab a towel. What? Look at that towel supply right there. Oh. Also, you can get started in five seconds. Three, two, one. Here we go. I'm in that good plank position. Don't let your butt get all up in the air. You'll know your butt's up in the air if your backpack starts going towards your ears. Twenty seconds left. Fifteen. Oh, why did I say I was gonna do push-ups? Five, four. Three, two, one. Take a break. Whew. Let me get the door open. All right. Five more seconds. Last round. Two, one. Here we go. Remember, head neutral spine. Just look forward. This should be the ground. Don't look at your feet. Don't look up. Just look at the ground. Fifteen seconds left. Five. Four, three, two, one. Oh, you're done. Oh. 
This is definitely a challenge. How'd you do? Did you have fun with that? Take a break. Wipe off your sweat. Do a little dance. If you're following along in Spotify, got some CR going. Got a minute left. Okay. Next move is a little bit complex. So I'm gonna try to break it down for you. So, take your bag. Okay. So, you're gonna lunge forward. So whichever side where you have space, or no, sorry, the other side. So, you're gonna lean forward. Yeah, and I'm gonna swoop up. All right, so how's that look again? So I'm gonna lunge forward. I have space on my left side. I'm gonna sweep up, okay? Lunge forward, sweep up, okay? I'm gonna start in 10 seconds. Actually, five, four, three, two, one. Lunge forward, sweep up. Other side. Lunge forward, sweep up. Lunge forward, sweep. I'm actually gonna do two in a row. Lunge forward, nice slow sweeps. Forward, sweep back to front. Sweep back to front. 10 more seconds. Three, two, one. Take a break. 15 seconds. Grab some water. We're gonna start up again. Three, two, one. Here we go. Forward, sweep up. back leg, so I got the knee bent. So it's got some balance element here. So if you're wobbly, take it slow. 10 more seconds. Five more seconds. Three. Two, one, take a break. One more time. You guys having fun with that one? So in five seconds, three, two, one, here we go. Think about scooping stuff up. Now, so I'm not leaning over excessively, scooping to the side. Thirteen seconds. Can you get a couple more reps? Five seconds. Three, two, one. Good job. Woo. How's it going? How's it going? Thumbs up. All right. Yeah, another minute. Take a break while I talk about the next move. So fun ones are different. All right. Next, we're going to take your pack. We're going to be lying down. You get to lie down. Have a nice smile. All right. So you're just going to hold the pack above your head. Okay? So you're going to start with your legs out. And you're gonna crunch them in side to side, okay? So not just straight in, side to side, okay? Yeah, another 40 seconds. 
So enjoy the break. Enjoy the dance break. That was the worst wave ever. Let's try it again, try it again. Savvy, why are you so sad? Is it the backpack? Is it is my dance moves? Wow, that's horrible. That is so horrible. All right, 15 more seconds. So make sure your back is flat on the ground. So you might wanna prep. We're starting in three. Back on the ground, two, one, into the side, out, into the side. Do a lot of side ab work today. So think about bringing those knees in towards each elbow. Use your elbow as targets. Eight more seconds. Now you can always do this, take a break. Here we can do these workouts just with body weight. If having the weight is too challenging for you, just do the motions you can work on you know, like for example, range of motion in your upright row, things like that. Here we go. Enough chin. Ooh, I don't know if the mic is picking this up, but my left hip oof, is like clicking at the when my legs are out. Ooh, there it goes again. So if you have any like clicking in your joints. Don't freak out. As long as it's not painful, it's okay, okay? Um, now, if it clicks and it's painful, then you should be more concerned. But if it just clicks, don't, don't freak out, okay? Two, one, take a break. Yeah, one more time on that. Whew. So this is not deodorant, this is actually some sunscreen. And um, my sister recommended it. Two, one, last round. So my sister recommended it. She's like, oh yeah, it's great. So I went for a hike, put in what I thought was all over my exposed skin. And then I got home and <laughs> realized there were like large slots of skin that I just completely missed um, because I was just sort of haphazardly rolling it. Um, that's the great thing about sunscreen. It will always tell you exactly what parts you missed. And then you have like really weird burn patterns. Keep breathing, keep bringing those hips in. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. Good job, that was fun. Feel the core action in. Oh, some of these moves go by so fast and then some of them, tricep raises are horrible. All right. Good job. Get a break, get a break. Uh, you're amazing, Sammy. Okay, so grab some water, towel yourself off, and I will show you the next move. So we're gonna do some lateral lunges. I'm gonna grab my big pack, because I feel like my big pack, okay? So what you're gonna do is, you're gonna lunge to one side, and then you're gonna sweep. Three, four, come back up. So other side, and you're gonna one, two, three, four, push back up, okay? Lunge, one, two, three, four, push up. Lunge, one, swinging it back and forth, okay? Just keep doing that. We have 15 seconds till we start again. All right, five, four, grab your backpack. Here we go. One, lunge, swing, 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 
Swing. Up. Lunge. Swing. 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 Up. Really push off with your heel when you come back up. So you have a little bit of a power movement. So I'm sort of swinging, I think I said four times to each side. Basically, I'm just starting and ending on the foot that's bad. Take a break. If you swing three times or four times, I'm not going to fault you. It's not that important. You're not going to die. All right, three seconds. Two, one, there we go. Maybe you kept going through that. My apologies. Come back up. I'm going to try to keep your shoulders not super like hunched over. Try to pull those shoulder blades back just a little bit. Oh, my sinuses. I can feel, feel the drainage. we got 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Take a break. If that's your first break in the last minute and a half, sorry about that. All right. That makes you that much stronger, comrade. Three, two, one, last round. Ooh, don't step on the strap. Let me make it sort of hard to come back up. Fifteen more seconds. I don't have any jokes right now. Insert your own joke here. Five more seconds. Three, two, one. Take a break. Awesome job. You are done with that move. Good job, good job, good job, good job, good job. The headless trainer congratulates you on a good job so far. Let's see. How much we got left? Well, we got another minute break. I do believe we have two moves left. How's everybody doing, by the way? Thumbs up. I want to see your response in 30 seconds. So, next one. No one's going to enjoy this. We're going to put our pack back on. It's doing bear crawls. So, but not like this. You're going to get your you're going to get your backpack on your head. So just low to the ground, butt down, crawl around, make whatever animal noises. How about a bear? Make some bear growls. Arr! Make some bear claws and eat them later. Um, we got 25 seconds left of this luxurious break, and I guarantee you're going to want to take advantage of it. Maybe apply some sunscreen haphazardly to your body. All right, got seven more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Bear crawl commence. Get that butt down. I'm just gonna do, I'll do some little lifts. You got 25 more seconds. Maybe you wanna do a backwards crawl. Ooh, tricky, tricky. But notice, my butt's still down. Whatever you do. Come and give me a high five. Bear high five on the screen. Five, four, Three, two, one. Take a break. Whew. Oh. Oh, 
some fun stuff. What do you think? All right, three, two, one. Let's go back around. Whoop. Here we go on my playlist, another song by from Clueless. Do you like that movie? If not, whatever. Oh, my quads. Whew. Again, you don't need a backpack to do this. It's torture, no matter what. Got 10 seconds left. I'm going to adjust my backpack. Five, four, three, two, one. Take a break. Oh, punch out those quads. Ow, 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 ow. Whew, shake it out. Fix your hair. Look good. One, here we go. Last round. The only bear I can do is Yogi. Hey, hey, hey. I need some more of those to pick any biscuits. Need some more of those backpacks filled with food. Ah, can I do go backwards around the world? Whew. Watch out for obstacles. Watch out for small children lying on the ground. Keep that butt down. Keep it to the side. 10 seconds until we're done with this horrible move. Three, woo, two, one, woo! Get that pack off. You deserve it. Woo. Oh my lord. Oh, shake it out. Punch out. Tenderize that meat. Good job, good job, good job. All right. We've got one last move. And my band aid's falling off. That's gross. Okay. Grab some water. I will do the same. I'll talk about this last move. All right. So last move. We're going to sort of sumo squat. So we're going to do start on one side. You're going to come up, lift, over, up, lift. Try to keep straight arms for this. Backpack gets too tough. Maybe take out a couple of oranges or books or concrete, whatever you have in here. All right? You're going to start in 15 seconds. <sighs> Oxygen, not just a good idea. Uh, it's the law. No, wait, that's gravity. All right, three. Two, one. So come up, down. Now, if you want to add a challenge, don't just come up, come up on your toes. Now try to keep your arms straight during the movement. And remember, if you don't want to come up on the toes, just do squat. 15 seconds. Keep those shoulders down. You're going to want to come up. Say hi to your ears. Don't let them. Three, two, one. Take a break. Anybody want to use band aid? No? Why not? Three, two, one. This is a backpack to spell off. Use band aids. Take it slow and controlled because you got straight arm raises and those are tough. If I haven't already said so, which I think I did, lighten up your load if you're having trouble. I'd rather you not strain yourself 
and have good form and push yourself too hard and have bad form and injuries. Three, two, one. Take a break. I'm going to take a book out. Glue lab. All right. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Oh, much more manageable. Form is a lot better. Don't have those micro bends in my arms. You know, there's always this, you know, like machismo thing, like I gotta be tough and show off. And you know, sometimes, you know, whether you're tired or just not ready, sometimes you just gotta lighten your load and there's no shame in that. Like, I get so frustrated when people are not willing to just put their guard down and be vulnerable. Two, one, take a break. I mean, if you push yourself too hard, you injure yourself, you're not gonna progress. Sometimes taking a step back and working with your limitations saves you and allows you to grow later. Last round, here we go. something wrong because it has me on the cool down. Is this a round four? Is this a bonus round? I didn't think I did a bonus round, but well, here's what it is. If this is a bonus round, then just say this is your last push for the day. So you can go up on those toes. Let's do, I'm gonna do four more. Three, two, one. You're done! Woo! Awesome job, awesome job. Thumbs up, two snaps in a circular rotation. Anybody remember that reference? All right. You guys good? Good job. All right, so that's all I got today. We're gonna do a cool down. I'm gonna skip this last song, go straight to the cool down song. So it was a little, actually, you know what? No, we'll finish, we'll finish now. Like, we're gonna do more. And you're like, no, I hate you. All right, so I'm gonna save the song for another time. All right, last song, cool down song in three, Two, one, here we go. How are you feeling? Let me know how you're feeling. I want to hear about it. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Then down, touch the floor. Have your legs wide apart. Bring your nose to your favorite knee, or in my case, just sort of like try to reach it. Like my nose is like, hi, I can't, I can't reach you. I've got like T-Rex arms. Okay, so whatever the opposite knee is, whatever knee you're not facing, bend it. Feel that stretch in the inner thigh. All right, extend it, walk over to the other side. Notice that knee, other, the second knee. Whatever knee you're not facing, bend it. Oof. So what exercises did you like today? What exercises did you not like? Extend the leg, come down, just sort of sway side to side. Shake your head yes, nod your head no. Hands down, bend your knees, come up slowly. Four, three, 
two, one, inhale, exhale, get up on one leg, pull that leg back, Woo. find a friend in your household to lean on, or in my case a lull, I don't have any friends, and swap it out, other side, so yeah, I appreciate your feedback, so if there's something that you liked or didn't like, or like, I didn't get to see that very well, next time could you do something like this? This helps me, I learn from you, so your feedback is welcome. Now, that being said, there are different ways you can help me out. Inhale, bring one foot out, flex it, and come back down. And that is, can you like my page or like my Instagram? Can you tell other people about it? Can you forward along these workouts and invite your friends to join? Um, my right foot's forward. I'm going to lean towards my right. Spread the word if you can. Also, if this workout made you smile, made you sweat, come back down. Stand up. Donations are always welcome. Inhale. Bend forward. Other side. Twist out. Come back down, feet together. Slowly raise up for three, two, one. Inhale. Exhale. So that's all that I got for today. Feel free to keep stretching if you need to. Do some shoulder stretches. Um, thank you so much for working out with me today. As I always say, you are that much stronger for showing up today and working out, if you hadn't shown up at all. And also, I love working out with you guys, so thank you for motivating me. Uh, again, donations welcome. Share with your friends. Um, interested in personal training or small group training? I'm your gal. Uh, and then, like I said, the schedule's changing next week, so look for that uh, later today. So have a great day, enjoy the rest of your weekend, and I will see you on Monday, hopefully. Well. I'm going to be here on Monday. Are you going to be here on Monday? So, Mwah. love you. Bye.